All right, taking a look at our weather situation now. This morning it was snowing, snizzling. Now it's kind of calmed down. We get some rain and okay. freezing rain, but I think it's turning over just a plain old rain across mm. most areas as temperatures are beginning to warm up a little bit. Good news there. We don't need any more rain though. No, we got more rain ahead. In fact, we got a flood watch for the end of the week. <laughs> Never, never stops. Uh, here's North Situate, and we are looking at wet roadways here, and uh, generally in good shape. Some of the side streets still could be a little on the snowy side. I'm looking at Newport here, and you can see some decent visibility. Might be a little bit of light rain or fog out there. We're still looking at a winter weather advisory for areas north and west of Providence. Temperatures out here are right around the freezing mark or just below it, and a little bit of light freezing rain falling. In fact, in the radar, you can see some snow showers coming in and actually beginning to transition over to some of that uh, freezing rain, a little bit of sleet, kind of focusing in on it. A lot of purples up here, which indicates a little bit of freezing rain from Boroughville all the way down, even into the Providence area. There could be a touch of freezing rain because here are the temperatures right at the freezing mark. And there could be some areas, especially some of the valleys where we're just below freezing, like 30, 31 degrees. So any of that rain could be freezing on contact. So there could be some slippery roads, especially those untreated roadways, even your front steps, sidewalks could be slick. Foster, Boroughville, got a couple reports from Boroughville with uh, amounts up to two inches. Woonsocket got an inch report, uh, Warren an inch, and Bristol picked up uh, about a half an inch of snow. Threat tracker for this morning elevated because of the uh, conditions of the roads. This afternoon, temperatures are a little warmer, uh, less of an impact. We'll, we'll still have some drizzle and some showers. Then Thursday through Saturday, we are looking at some more rain. Actually, an inch to inch and a half now through Friday morning. Some flood Flooding possible, and we've got a flood watch in effect for that time frame. End of the week into Saturday. Yeah, temperatures low to mid 30s, coldest north and west of the city right now. Everywhere else, 32 to 34. We got the stuff moving through this morning, a little bit of everything, and here comes one batch of rain that's kind of gathering out across the uh, Midwest. A second batch down in the deep south. That all, both of them will be coming through over the next couple of nights. So hour by hour forecast, kind of pinpoint things for you, and we are looking looking at some rain and snow and some freezing rain this morning and then just a lot of clouds of drizzle couple of showers in the afternoon. Another round of rain arrives after the evening commute around for much of the night and then begins to dive off to our south early tomorrow. We might start the day with some rain tomorrow though and as we go into tomorrow night late in the night another round of a widespread rain pushing on through out of here Friday morning and then we get a bit of a break for like a day and a half. Rainfall forecasts between now and through Friday morning about an inch to inch and a half and that could lead to some flooding some street poor drainage flooding river flooding and that flooding potential is more for uh, Thursday night and through the daytime on Friday and with the rivers we'll have to watch them on through Saturday as well so for this morning looking at rain snow sleet freezing rain and just plain old shower and drizzle throughout the rest of the morning hours temperatures today will be topping out at around 39 40 degrees or so uh, looking at some uh, rain tomorrow night on Friday, we're looking at the sun to return. It'll be around Saturday. Rain turns to snow on Sunday. WPRI.com. That's where you can go for the updated forecast whenever you would like it. Here's Melissa now with our final.